Welcome home. You... Remember me? We met in Bavel. Uh... Yeah? But that wasn't the first time we met. I've known about you for a long time. A long, long time. I... I feel like I know you too. Where are we? <laughs> Silly, don't recognize your own home? What's gotten into you, hey? Wake up! Wake up! Wait, this is a dream. Precisely. A dream? Are you crazy? I don't have time to be dreaming now. You're wrong. It's not that you're dreaming. You are a dream. Huh, wait a sec. Long ago, there was a war. Yeah, with Machina, right? Yes, a war between Xanarkand and Bavel. Bavel's Machina assured their victory from the start. Spira had never seen such power. The summoners of Xanarkand didn't stand a chance. Xanarkand was doomed to oblivion. That's why we tried to save it, if only in a memory. What did you do? The remaining summoners and the townspeople that survived the war. They all became Faith. Faith for the summoning. The summoning? You mean Sin? No. I mean this place. A Xanarkand that never sleeps. What? what? The dreams of the Faith summoned the memories of the city. They summoned all the buildings, all the people who lived there. The people? What? They're all dreams? Me? Too? Yes, you're a dream of the Faith. You, your father, your mother, everyone, all dreams. And if the faith stopped dreaming... No. no! So, so what, what if I'm a dream? dream? I... I like being here. We've been dreaming so long. We're tired. Would you and your father... Would you let us rest? Both you and your father have been touched by Sin. Sin, the one around whom all Spira... The spiral evolves. What are you saying? You two are more than just dreams now. Wake up! Wake up, please! Just a little more, and maybe... Maybe you or the dream that will end our dreaming at last. Are you all right? Oh, phew. Hey, we were...
were so worried about you. You okay? I... I'm okay. What happened? Nothing. I blacked out. I was dreaming. <laughs> you called me. And I woke up. <sighs> Nothing like a good nap. Well, I'm ready. Let's go. Looks like we got a job to do, yeah? If anything should happen in the water, we're relying on you three. If it gets dangerous, pull out quick. Right. Be careful, okay? us soon. She has sent fiends to test our summoner's strength. Who is she? Unaleska. Lady Unaleska! In Xanarkin, she awaits the arrival of the strongest. She is still alive? As much as Micah and Seymour. I see. Lost your nerve? No. Nothing frightens me now. <laughs> Braska would be proud. Then I must not let him down. It comes!
Just a little. No need. We reach the summit soon. I know. That's why I want to stop for a bit. Soon means that there's not much time left. Riku. Fine. I'll think on the way. Hey, come on. Let's go. We are... almost there, aren't we? <sighs> We've come a long way. <laughs> What's so funny? You remind me of myself. Before, the closer I came to Xanarkin, the more I wondered. When we arrive, Brasco will call the final Aeon. He will fight Sin, then die. I thought my mind was made up long before. But when I stood here, my resolve wavered. Hmm. Never would have figured. Legendary Guardians choke sometimes too, yeah? Huh? <laughs> Legendary Guardian? I was just a boy. A boy about your age, actually. I wanted to change the world, too. But I changed nothing. That is my story. city dead for a thousand years. A city I had to see with my own eyes. The end of Yuna's journey. The last chapter in my story. My thoughts, they kept floating up and then slipping through my fingers. Slipping away before I could pin them down with words. Yuna, I say no. If we go down there, then you'll... Riku. You're a true friend, and I thank you, but I must go down to Sanarkand. I'm not saying we shouldn't go, but should we think about it some more? There's got to be some kind of way we can save you, Yuna! All my life, I knew this moment would come. Yuni! Thank you, Riku. Thank you for everything. Don't say that, Yumi. It's not over yet. Tell Sid, thank you. No, you can tell him yourself. We're gonna see each other again, okay? Kimari, let's go. Sir Oren, Kimari told me. When my father wanted me taken from Bavel to Besaid, it was you who told Kamari, right? I had always wanted to meet you someday. I am truly glad that I had that chance. Having you as a guardian was so great an honor. I don't know how to thank you. Perhaps if I defeat Sin, that will be my thanks to you. That's what I'll do. Yes. I will challenge Sin. 
I will defeat Sin. If you are all there watching this, then I guess Sin is already gone. And so am I. I suppose. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to say, Sir Orin, uh, I thank you. Kimari, <laughs> do you remember the first day we met? I was only seven. My father had defeated Sin, and all Bavel was celebrating. Everyone was saying what a hero my father was. I was so happy. But when night came, it occurred to me. My father had defeated Sin, and now he was dead. Now I was all alone. I couldn't sleep. So I wandered into the town, away from the celebrating crowds. I stood on the bridge in Bavel, where my father and I had parted. Standing there, alone, I could see the fields where he had fought Sin. Then, you appeared, Kamari. You said you were looking for the daughter of Braska, remember? At first, I was so scared until I realized what a gentle person you are. <laughs> you weren't used to talking to children. When I told you that I was Braska's daughter, you said you would take me as far from Bavel as you could. That it was the wish of a man facing death. I think I cried then, because that that was when I knew my father was dead, and I would never see him again. You just held me, without saying a word. I cried after we got to Besaid, too. When you tried to go, after leaving me in the care of the temple, I held on to you crying, don't go, don't go. And you listened, Kimari. You stayed. Kimari, thank you. Thank you so much. And I've always liked your broken horn. Waka, Lulu. I'll never forget my days spent with you, growing up in Besaid. We always played together, us and Chapu. That's why I was always so happy, I think. And when you refused to let me become a summoner, and I did it anyway? I'm sorry. I've always wanted to apologize. You know, when you tried to stop me then, really, I was happy. I could tell you really cared about me. You were like my big brother and sister. No, I think you really were my big brother and sister. What else? <laughs> I love watching you play Blitzball, Waka. <laughs> I even love it when you scold me, Lulu. <laughs> really? I guess that leaves the newest guardian. Star player of the Xanarkand Abes. This is what it feels like. It's a much more wonderful feeling than anything I had ever imagined. Wonderful. But it hurts sometimes. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder. I... <laughs> I just want to say thank you for everything. <laughs> Maybe... Maybe that's why it hurts. When I... When I think about us never being together again at all. 
I'm afraid. No, I shouldn't say that. I'll do that part over. Um. What you up to? Listen to my story. This may be our last chance. Hey! There was more, right? I mean, like that time... Uh, anyone? I think... Yes? I think that we should stop... Maybe... For now.
journeyer of the long road, name yourself. I am the summoner Yuna. I have come from the island of Besaid. Your eyes, my dear, show me the long road you have traveled. Very good. You have journeyed well. Lady Unaleska will surely welcome your arrival. Go to her now, and bring your guardians with you. Go. Yes. If it might benefit the future of Spira, I will gladly give my life. It is the highest honor for which a guardian might ask. Use my life, Lady Yoken, and rid Spira of sin. What? What was that? Our predecessors. She said Lady Yoken, didn't she? Wait, she guarded High Summoner Yoken? This dome is filled with fireflies. It's like one gigantic sphere. People's thoughts remain here, forever. <laughs>